That was a beautiful pass there from Garcia. Nice patience shown by him and just sauce that one right on the tape. Another pass ahead. Ward in. Shot scores. Robert Ward, top shelf, glove side. one nothing Flames. Must have been a pretty good talking last night. That's right. This is why Ward is so versatile out there. What a move as he has two guys draped all over him. He protect, protects the puck so well here. And man, can this guy ever snipe? Take another look at this. He has to protect it by taking it out away from the net. But he gets the shot up over the glove right there. What a nice goal. And the Liberty Flames up 1-0. Sending in front. Ward with a spin. Flames here. Showing off the nifty moves. Ward with it deep. Has it on the back end. Pass in front. Miller shot scores. The hottest flame, Riley Egan, on the back door. A tap in goal. This was one of the prettier passing plays we've seen in a while. It was just connecting. Tic tac toe for the flames. Riley Egan, right spot, right time. And this is as easy as it's going to come for number 91. The Flames up 2-0 as we're going to get a replay right here. Ward, nice pass out. And Miller, great Beauty. job pinching in from the point. Has the vision, knows that Egan is right there in front. He gets it over. It's a for sure goal. He does. And the Flames now enjoy the two-goal lead. Kerr looking to keep it in. Lorelei. Wainwright. Brings it into the offensive zone. Drops it over. Spinning. Murray had it taken off his stick. Here comes Garland. He had a breakaway last night. Tonight, scores! What a goal! Christian Garland! Happy Valentine's Day. That thing was lovely. Beautiful goal there. Garland did it yesterday. He had the chance. He went off the blocker. Today, he goes to the deep blocker side, but it works. This was a thing of beauty. Uses his speed, protecting the puck. Nice little fake there. And then he goes off as he buries this thing, looking like Bobby Orr. Oh, that was a Tony Amane move. Mm. His dad must have loved Tony back when he played for the old Hawks. 3-0 the Flames there. Way to go, Christian. Adding a third for the Flames on a nice breakaway goal. Egan, pass in front, Ward was there. It was behind the back play. If they had connected, that would have been gorgeous. Garvin will cycle it low, Egan with it now. Now a pass in front, Ward scores. Robert Ward, second one of the night. Wait for the horn. First one was off of a great shot. This one was just... Nice puck movement. Yeah, it was great puck movement by the entire line. He was in the right spot at the right time. Flames going up now by a score of 4 nothing. This has also been another pretty good line tonight as Egan Ward have been pretty, uh, pretty good on this weekend offensively for the Liberty Flames, especially missing. Here comes Zach Ledoux. Takes it to the outside, tried to cut back in. Blue got him. Quickly played ahead. Egan tracking down the puck. Forens plays it to the boards. Ward in front. Garvin shot score. No Selly is the best Selly. 5 nothing Liberty. Only a matter of time before the tower number 1-7 gets on the board. Egan's been up there. Ward has two tonight. Now Garland. Buries the back of the net with a nice one. Five hole. And it was a very nice passing play by Liberty Flames. Making no mistake and decides just to go five hole right there. And well done. Most guys are just going to try and look to pick a corner. Reverses it off the end board. Sherry. Pass. Lamaru. Cross ice. Miller pokes it ahead. Brought across the line by Simone. Played through some legs. Pass in front. Scores! What a beautiful passing play. Once again, Kyle 
Miller involved. Not seeing much time all season long, and he's come out with a couple of beautiful primary assists tonight. Wow, this was tic-tac-toe. Beautiful, beautiful passing play by the Flames. They are heating up here in this third period. They keep getting better. Take another look at this one. Miller behind the back to Lammer, and it's just that's just good hockey sense. He doesn't even have to look up. He just knows where the goaltender is going to be sliding across. If he can get it and pour it back into that far side, it's got an easy goal. He does. It's a really nice passing play. The Flames connect with three beauty passes on as far as he needed to in, in order to get a, a clear shot through right there. Play back up around the boards. High slot. Garvin shot. Scores. <laughs> would ever shoot high again. The two goals he scored today, nice and low, right along the ice. Take another look. He had some struggles yesterday, even earlier in the game, just trying to go roof daddy. But today, second and third period, I guess they both came in the third here. Yep, both shots nice and low. One five hole, another one right there. The Flames have a nice, comfortable seven, nothing to lead. Shot towards the goal, held on to. You know, I want to say this on a sad note really quick. The member of the hockey family here at Liberty had a significant loss, Sarah Fowler. Um, her mom passed away recently, uh, losing her battle to cancer, which is, is very tough, very sad. Yeah. And uh, we just be, you know, keep the family in your thoughts and prayers. And Sarah hopefully can come back and be with her girls on their national trip. That's going to do it. Liberty Flames. Flames, this win this one 7-0. We'll be back after the commercial with more post-game analysis. <laughs>